Tom Shuba of the Chicago Sun-Times reports that Athletics outfielder Dustin Fowler has filed suit against the White Sox for negligence. Fowler sustained a season-ending injury during a collision at Guaranteed Rate Field last June and is also bringing the lawsuit against the Illinois Sports Facilities Authority Agency, as neither party took measures to secure the ballpark's unpadded electrical box that exacerbated his injuries. The 22-year-old outfielder was just two outs into his Major League debut with the Yankees when the incident occurred. Fowler tracked a Jose Abreu foul ball down the first baseline and flipped over the short railing. He was noticeably limping after colliding with a knee-high electrical box at the wall and collapsed to the ground within seconds before being carted off the field. The official diagnosis a ruptured patellar tendon and season-ending surgery on his right knee. Per Shuba's report, which can be read here in, Fowler has claimed severe and permanent external and internal injuries, as well as mental pain and anguish, following the collision. No specific demands have been publicized yet. Fowler is said to be seeking money from both the White Sox and the Sports Facilities Authority, likely enough to cover the large sums he spent on medical care for the surgery and related treatments. Follow at Wick Coast Fangirl The Padres announced, on Sunday that the club signed pitcher Jordan Lyles to a one-year Major League contract with a club option for 2019. According to John Heyman of FanRag Sports, Lyles will earn $750,000 in 2018. Pitcher Travis Wood was designated for assignment to create room on the 40-man roster for Lyles. Lyles, 27, had miserable results between the Rockies and Padres last season, compiling an aggregate 7.75 era with a 5,522 KBB ratio over 69-23 innings. While he specifically gave up 24 earned runs in 23 innings across five starts with the Padres, it was a small sample. A season at the pitcher-friendly Petco Park, as opposed to Colorado's Coors Field, might help revitalize his career. Wood, 30, went to the Padres at the non-waiver trade deadline from the Royals this past season. Overall, the lefty posted an aggregate 6.80 era with a 6,545 KBB ratio in 94 innings. He'll earn $6.5 million this season and has an $8 million mutual option with a $1 million buyout for 2019. So, the Padres are just eating $7.5 million minus the league minimum, assuming Wood latches on elsewhere. Follow at Bear, Bill.